bracelet number one that deal with question number one to question number four. Instructions just will go through and based on that instruction we'll try to solve the questions. What are the given questions? The CTs C1, C2, C3, C4 and C5 are connected by different modes of transport. Once it is mentioned different modes of transport then immediately we should clarify or we should just look the questions how many type of transport has given here. That is first thing we have to. Here it is given total four five type five type of transport that is boat rail bus and air only four type boat rail bus and air only four type of transport means between any two cities you have the possible mode of transport four maximum that will give you the idea to find how many different way to reach from one city to another city that mathematically you will be able to define between any two city maximum number of mode of transport can be four but all four are applicable between two cities that we don't know that we have to look the conditions or information given in case let now further information is given about the different city how they are connected by different mode of transport c1 and c2 are connected by boat and rail and remaining two it is not connected means through bus or through air you can't go from c1 and c2 here again one thing you just try to differentiate between type of routes and this here type of routes is not a matter means c1 and c2 are connected by boat and rail means either you can go from c1 to c2 or c2 to c1 but you have only two option either you can go through boat or you can you can just pick the train c3 and c4 are connected by bus and boat means only we have to decide how many different options or different modes of transport we have to connect between two cities any two cities or if we want to reach from any one particular city to another city then how many different routes or different possibility is available just we'll go through the based on the given information just we'll make one diagram and uh, based on the diagram solving the question will become easy like here c1 c2 c3 c5 and c4 now just will connect by given the information c1 and c2 by boat and rail like this and uh, c3 and c4 it is connected by bus and boat and c2 and c5 are only air c1 and c3 only by boat and c3 and c5 are rail and bus that much information given means whatever information given in your case slate that we can summarize in this diagram this is called network diagram this network diagram based on this we will able to solve all questions we have to put little bit logic little logic and we will able to solve it just will come question number one which pair of cities are connected by any of the routes directly any of the routes directly means in between it is not coming uh, in between you you no need to change the mode of transport no need to change your mode of transport like uh, just will come which pair of cities are connected by any of the routes directly c1 and c5 c1 and c5 no it is not connected by direct route in between c2 is coming if in between if in between c2 is coming then we can't say it is a direct route direct route means between no intermediate stations or no city c4 and c5 here it is c4 here it is c5 direct it is there no if you want to go from c4 to c5 you must cross c3 or you have to cross c3 c1 c2 all three means this is also not this is also not c2 and c3 c2 and c3 again no direct connection c2 and c5 that is only direct connection means d will be your correct choice but these questions has become easy or this question you can say easy category because once you are understood this network diagram it will become but making network diagram always it will not easy you must careful all the information given in the case slate if any information you missed or you misinterpreted all questions may be wrong this is the risk here if any case slate di or lr 
if one information you misinterpret and you have represented in different way it can affect all your three four questions or maybe out of four question two hundred two questions hundred percent would be right that also can become wrong just we'll come to the question number two if aman traveled from c2 to c4 c2 is here c4 is here okay without changing the mode of transport then find the route and mode of transport it means c2 to c4 he has two option either he can come like this or he can come like this these only two option we have which route or which option is is available without changing the mode of the transport just we'll start just we'll look here one is c2 to c5 c5 to c3 and c c3 to c4 like this route okay another is c2 to c1 c1 to c3 and c3 to c4 in first possibility if c2 to c5 we are coming you don't have option you must go from air if c5 to c3 you are coming then you have the option rail or bus c3 to c4 you have the bus and boat then coming from c5 to c3 and c3 to c4 you can opt same mode of transport that is bus this option is available here also bus here also bus but c2 to c5 you don't have option only air is available means if this route we are following you must pick two mode of transport minimum minimum maximum you have to pick three mode of transport but minimum you have to pick air and bus means no common mode of two complete journey means possibility number one is not valid just we look possibility number two c2 to c1 c2 to c1 c1 to c3 and c3 to c4 c2 to c1 we have the option boat and rail c1 to c3 we have option boat and here we have option the bus and boat what is here interesting point interesting point is we have boat here also we, uh, we have boat here also and by chance boat is available here also means we can say all are flooded region heavy flood is there due to boat are available for all the regions or all these connecting cities means here we can choose boat to come from c2 to c4 without changing the modes of transport just will come to the question number three that will give you the more confidence to solve this type of questions if niva started from city c1 and returned back to c1 i don't know why i started and why returning that, that that is not our business but as per mathematical information niva started from c1 and returning back again c1 then which of the place must be visit twice niva visited all five cities during this journey this is a condition if last condition not given means we can uh, escape we can escape to visit any city twice because it is not necessary to visit all five cities but if condition is imposed you must visit all five cities then we have to look which city can be repeated just based on the given network diagram from c1 niva can start in two way one is this way one other is this way means two possibility will be there two routes can be defined one is c1 to c2 c2 to c5 c5 to c3 c3 to c4 again c4 to c3 and again c1 which are repeating c3 like here c1 to c2 c2 to c5 c3 c4 again come back to c3 again going back to c1 next route is c1 to c3 c3 to c4 because one c3 if niva is going towards c5 then c will not able to touch the c4 because c will not get again opportunity once c has crossed from c3 towards c5 c will not get opportunity to touch the c5 or visit the c visit the c4 then it must be from c3 c take one uh, first uh, diversion toward ct c4 and again coming back from c4 and afterwards will go towards c5 and will go to c2 and c1 in c1 to c3 c3 to c4 c4 to c3 c5 c2 in this case also c3 must be covered twice overall questions are 
EG and option will become C3 must visit twice. Just will come to the next question. Niva again trying to travel somewhere. If Niva wants to visit all five cities, but condition is only one time mode of transport can be changed. I mean, just suppose if C has started from boat, then during during visit to all five cities, only one time C can change from boat boat to maybe rail or bus or air. If this is starting from air, then only one option or only one opportunity she will get to change from air to boat, rail or boat, boat, rail or bus. Means we have to just choose a starting point very judiciously to keep this condition alive. If a starting point we will not able to pick properly, this condition will break and Finally, we will not able to visit all five cities with this condition. Then just will try to try to pick which point can give you the maximum stretch of travel in one mode of transport. Like here, only one option will come here C2 to C1, C2 to C1 and C1 to C3 and again C3 to C4. This a stretch can be traveled by only one mode of transport and that is boat that is boat means four cities can be covered with only one mode of transport and what is our worry one more city we have to cover with uh, one more mode of transport just will just will take this city c5 we'll start with c5 we'll go to c2 c1 c3 c4 here it is uh, started with air change to boat continue to the boat Means from here, from air, Niva is coming to the water and continue to the boat and reaching to uh, reaching up to C4 and covered all five cities.